All right, so we got here is obviously my 2000 Chevy Tahoe. Um, just to prove a point here, I'm just gonna lay that like that. I have a dead battery. It, voltage came up a little bit there from being hooked up to an additional battery, but oh well. Okay, so it started itself this time. Um, but how I got to that point was I have a Milwaukee Impact with me, and I have jumper cables. So I have the 18-volt lithium-ion battery, and what you can see here is because Milwaukee was so nice to label the battery for you positive and negative side, I stuck a um, jigsaw blade on the positive side, put the positive cable there, and a screwdriver on the negative side, Put the negative cable there. Um, so to prove my point, I'm going to see if I can actually kill this battery again quick. Oh, hold on. Alright, so you can hear everything's not happy about the dead battery. If I turn the key on, you'll see the gauge barely comes up to 9 volts even which is that gauge up there. Um, I know it's hard to see, my camera doesn't focus because my lens is broken. So you kind of get what you get here. So we'll turn everything back off for a minute. Come back out here. And you'll see I got the positive cable disconnected on this end so I could re-kill my battery quick. And we'll just plug that back on right there. Come back into the truck. You can see I got my dome light on again now. That comes back on. Battery voltage goes all the way back up to almost 14. And look at that. We're running. Just like that. So if you're ever in a pinch and you got a Milwaukee battery, just give that a shot. Get some jumper cables. Find a way to stick something in there so you can hook them up to the battery itself. And voila! Um, I actually didn't think that would work. I thought I was going to have to leave that sit there for a bit and let it basically let it recharge the battery and then try to start it. But uh, apparently, Milwaukee came through. I tried this one time with a DeWalt drill battery and it didn't work at all. I mean, it brought my voltage up enough to, to make my battery voltage gauge come up, but it wouldn't start the truck. So with that, I'd say Milwaukee is definitely the way to go, and they uh, pulled through again. So nice job, Milwaukee.